Hello everybody, welcome back to my second video. Just wanted to talk a little bit about uh, the salt I use as well as the containers. So right now I'm using the Red Sea Salt. Um, I like it, there are definitely some problems over here. Let me just zoom in here, you can see. So for most of you that have LPS or SPS tanks um, or even just like to keep the calcium and alkalinity levels higher, when you do water changes with this salt, you're generally lowering your calcium, magnesium, and alkalinity levels. Me personally, I like to keep my calcium about 430 and my alkalinity uh, around 9 to 10 and my magnesium up around 1350. So when I do my weekly water changes right now, I'm actually lowering um, a lot of my parameters. But that being said, you're still reducing your ammonia levels and your nitrate levels and uh, you're also adding back in the essential elements, which uh, two-part doesn't doesn't do. Um, will I be buying this again? No, I will be sticking with Red Sea, but I will be getting their Coral Pro because uh, it comes with a higher calcium, magnesium, and alkalinity levels, which suit my tank a lot better. So I live in a small apartment, so I have two 20-gallon brute tanks um, that I store my water in. Uh, I have to fill them up about once a month each. So over here is just my RODI water. And then this one over here is where I mix my salt water. Um, really important, some mistakes I made when I started out, you absolutely need to heat your salt water uh, as well as aerate it. Um, when I started doing water changes uh, with just the heat, um, uh, my pH swings were just immense, just huge, immense pH swings. Um, but once I started aerating it, all I have for aerating it, I don't know if you can see, sorry, there's a pretty bad reflection there. Um, I just have a Cobalt MJ1200. And then uh, for my heater, I have an Eheim Jaeger. Uh, which is fantastic. I don't run it all the time. I run it at least 24 hours before I do my water change. I do about a 10% water change every single week, um, which is fine with me. It's pretty simple. It doesn't stress me out at all. Uh, and I just think it's the healthiest way um, to do it. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching my video and I hope you're all well. Take care.